and NPC uncovers 4 km illegal oil connection operated for over 9 years. Managing Director of the Nigerian National Petroleum Company Limited Military on Tuesday revealed that the company has uncovered an illegal 4 km connection from Focado's oil pipeline in Delta State to the sea and a loading port that has operated in the last 9 years. Carey made the revelation when he appeared before a joint Senate committee on upstream, downstream and gas, lamenting that though oil theft in Nigeria has been on for over 22 years, the rate it has assumed in recent times is unprecedented. Carey revealed that the three operational facilities of Focados, Boni and brass oil terminals have all been shut down as a result of the high rate of crude oil theft leading to the loss of about 600,000 barrels per day. The managing director of NPC Limited further revealed that in the last six weeks there has been a spill site in Bori community in River State which may affect the Trans Nimbe pipeline coming into operation if not count. Adding that the spill has led to the country losing 120,000 barrels per day in addition to the hundreds of illegal refineries in the country. He further stated that in the course of the clampdown, the company has destroyed 350 illegal refineries, 273 wooden boats taken down, 374 reservoirs destroyed. Others are 1,561 metal tanks destroyed, over 49 seized trucks burnt down, 898 dock outpits destroyed, as well as 1,219 ovens taken down. He said the implications of the destruction is worse than the Ogoni spillage devastation in the affected areas, which has decimated agriculture and fishing in the communities. He explained that in addressing the menace, NFPCL carried out area surveillance of the affected areas and observed that the economy saboteurs carried out their activities unchallenged. After over four hours of interface, the lawmakers proposed that capital punishment be put in place for offenders which will be presented at plenary for consideration. Reporting for GOK TV.